Yeah, the conditions weren't great. Um, we're blessed out here at Arena. Um, the, the ground conditions were okay considering the amount of rain. I'm sure some of the other grounds probably don't take the, the water as well as we do here. So it was mainly having to contend with the wind and it, you know, made it difficult to judge where the ball was going. But I thought the players' intent for the majority of the game was fantastic. Um, it was always going to be a contested ball type game in these conditions. Um, we haven't gone that well against Eastern Mall up here in, in recent history, so it was great to get the, the win. And you know, we, we can now you know, sit back over the bye and, and enjoy a little bit of time off before we, we start working hard again. Looking forward to East Perth after the bye. You can trust me not to think, and not to sleep around. Yeah, it was. We're, we're getting closer, I think. Um, some of the some of the guys who have come in haven't played a lot of footy over over their careers. You know, road handful of games, Meadows, uh, Rotham, Lynch. So these guys are only going to get better. Um, Chris Channon was a late withdrawal on Thursday night for us. Um, so you know, we, we we are exposing a lot of kids to to games, and and that's been one of the um, one of the offshoots to having a few injuries. So yeah, we're really excited about that and I think they'll be better um, the more games they play. Yeah, look, um, we're aware that there's been a couple of you know, injuries to key position players. It's not something that we focus on. Um, that's something we can't control, so to speak. You know, we're more about, you know, once the players get in the side, that, they work hard and, and play their role and you know, that's all sounds cliched but um, you know, we, we can't help the fact that we've got available um, so just expect the players who, who are there do their job and I've been really pleased with, with the development of some of our young kids. We've made no secret, and I've said it a couple of times, that yeah, we've, we've made no secret of the fact that we're trying to move the ball better. Um, Mike Lowry is obviously having a positive effect, even though over the last two or three weeks he hasn't kicked that many goals, um, as you saw today, to be able to draw their best defender um, and then allow Ryder when he went forward, Fowler and those type of guys to, to Pop up. It's probably something we haven't had in my time. He's a genuine power forward who who competes hard and, and is rarely beaten. Um, we'd like him to take more catches and kick more goals, but um, I think it's it's clearly straightening us up and, and making it easier for our smaller forwards to predict where the ball's going. And um, you know, Cody Manning, crumb goal, we're getting more out of our mids. So, you know, we're it, it's not by accident, we've worked hard, but we know there's a lot of work still to be done in that area. Yeah, it's a, our second 16 day break, I think. Um, we'll give the guys a couple of days off, train a couple of times this weekend and, and have the, the state weekend off. Um, well, that sounds great to the players, they'll, they'll do a fairly uh, intensive session the Thursday night before the long weekend um, and we'll probably be able to get just a little bit more volume into them on the Monday night when generally it's a recovery type night so um, we'll just up their volume a little bit and then taper that off closer to, to the WA day um, 30. I think all of them could play. I'm not on the state selection panel and it depends on what they want. Um, it wouldn't surprise me if they all played, um, but then, you know, it depends what the, the state selectors want. There was probably a handful of guys today across the competition that needed to prove their fitness. Um, look, I think if all of them played, they'll, they'll put a good account of themselves and, you know, we're, we're really wrapped that we've got so many in the squad. I think also there's a couple others could probably play, you know, Cody Manning's not getting a lot of the ball, but I thought today his effort was very good again. So um, we'll wait and see, and, and hopefully Harrow might be able to get a couple of West Perth people across the line.